On today, the threat for severe weather. Here's a snapshot of what you can expect for Friday. There's still a chance we get a stray shower this morning, but most of those storms are pushing off to the south and we're drying out. So we'll have the clouds around today. It's going to be breezy for the majority of the day. And then the chance for strong severe storms really goes up after 7 p.m. Here's severe weather outlook, enhanced risk, Falls City, Lincoln, York, Beatrice, back toward Kearney. This is the area we'll watch for storms to develop around 6, 7 o'clock this evening. And this is also the area that has the better chance to see the potential for tornadoes along with large hail and damaging wind gusts. So our window of opportunity between 7 p.m. and midnight here in the Omaha Metro. Tornado threat a little bit lower, but not zero. But our main concerns will be large hail and damaging wind gusts, 67 and 70 mile per hour gusts possible, especially as, as we head toward 8, 9, 10 o'clock. So with it being in the evening, make sure you have a reliable way to receive alerts. If you're going to be out and about starting off your weekend, if you're in for Berkshire weekend or heading to the Storm Chasers game later on this evening. Here's Storm Predictor this morning. Any little thunderstorms will be off to our south. We could have a stray shower here through 8, 9 o'clock in Omaha. Otherwise, we'll be mainly dry. The clouds sticking around even with the stronger southeast breeze. Temperatures not warming up a whole lot around 60 at lunchtime into the mid 60s this afternoon. This model hinting at maybe a few little stray showers north of us early in the evening, but it's off to our southwest where it's going to be a little bit warmer, likely seeing a little bit of clearing. And there we go. Seven o'clock storms firing up and then quickly moving north and east. There's nine o'clock, 10 o'clock through the metro, 11 midnight, one o'clock continuing to push into southwest Iowa. So moving through the evening and then moving out overnight. This is right now dual pole super Doppler radar showing uh, a few showers off to the east Pottawatomie County toward Atlantic and then a few showers near the Lincoln area. That's a look outside right now. Cloudy skies looking over Highway 370, 72nd Street. Watch out for the potential for wet roads, even though we're drying out at least right now. 58 degrees southeast breeze around 15 miles per hour. See those temperatures, 50s, low 60s right now. There are the storms overnight that are now moving out. This is the same system that dumped five to seven inches of rain near Platte Center, caused some flooding issues there. These storms, maybe a rumble of thunder near Beatrice Falls City, maybe as far north as Lincoln, Nebraska City this morning. But the low is out to our west, and that will be moving east through today. So the warm front is going to be near the Kansas border. Storms firing up this evening and then racing northeast with the low through the nighttime hours. And then for Saturday, on the back end of this, we're going to get wraparound showers, stronger west wind, and much cooler for your weekend. So temperatures dropping back into the 50s as we start May. And then it's going to be cool, wet into next week. But again, we've got severe weather in the forecast tonight after 7 p.m. Make sure you have the KETV mobile app downloaded. Interactive Radar, Storm Alerts, latest forecast right there on the home screen.